this lesson, we're going to show you an overview of contacts. We'll show you how to add, export, search, and filter through your contact records to stay organized. So let's dive into the screen share and have a look. Contacts are probably the most important record. And until recently, contacts were the only object that existed in the CRM. We now have a company object, and that is another lesson. But let's see how to add a new contact. So I've gone to the menu, go to contacts, we click on add, and this now allows us to add some contacts. The usual information, first name, last name, and so on. I get to choose whether or not it is a customer or a lead. I can choose if they're already unsubscribed to a specific channel and I can choose the time zone. Adding a contact here will create a new contact record and not ask me any additional information. When I then want to edit a contact, I can click on the little logo, which is their profile picture. Otherwise you get the initials in a box. Once we click that, we can now see this is the contact card showing the details of the contact. And then there's some additional information grouped into different areas. We've got the general information, which is information surrounding their business and location, and then additional information. Now this additional information is based on custom fields, which we'll talk about in a later lesson. There's the actions panel, which gives us an, a number of actions that we can take against this contact in, individually and various other areas of functionality here. The middle pane is the conversations pane. I can assign this contact to somebody and then I have the activity to give me a list of recent activity, tasks, notes, and appointments with this contact. To delete a contact, we could simply click the record, click the delete, and it will ask us to confirm that action by clicking confirm. That is it for now. We're gonna dive a lot deeper into contacts, but for now, contacts 101, we'll see you in the next lesson.